¿Qué hay en un plan centenario? Mm. Hi, good morning. Good morning, sir. Good morning, sir. So, how many have, uh, uh, you know, how many joined now? Here only it's saying 22. What about others? Where are the others? Attendees, you know, attendees 22, presenters 1. What is this in invite others from conversation? Will they come here in attendance attend, attend, as attending? Indeed. Okay, so. Maybe it says like, uh, you know, invite others from conversation. Are they in conversation? Can anybody respond? Yes, sir. Are these people, you know, 80, 68 people are the same classes, are from same class? Thirty-four. Okay. So, so actually, in some areas, network is shut down. So most many students are not able to join. Okay, in home, na? In their homes. Yes, sir. Okay. So now, okay, we'll start. No problem. Uh, somebody is coming in you know, slowly, one by one. And uh, okay, so the the top, I know I just shared the, the screen of it, a window. Uh, you know, separate. Uh, so, is this visible? 
Yes, sir. It's mindset, right? So the team's calendar is visible. Sorry. It's showing the team's calendar. Screen is not coming. Okay, wait, wait, wait then. How about now? Yes, sir. Is coming? Okay. So, you know, uh, today's topic is uh, mindset, you know, it is one of the important and very crucial, you know, for everyone, you know, as far as uh, soft skills is concerned. So, uh, in this class, uh, I think you might have heard the word, you know, many people used to say this word. See, in the in, in, see, uh, we have completed two topics. One is emotional intelligence, and then another is, you know, uh, perceptions, personality, and their personality traits, you know, uh, all that. So it is also connected. Mindset is also, uh, some or another way, is closer to those topics. OK. So it is. It has still a different dimension. Uh, have you heard the word? You know, mindset. People used to say, you know, from anybody. And what do they mean? You know, uh, when they say mindset. Uh, in this class, no. I will uh, uh, in this uh, topic. You know, we'll talk about, and uh, also. Um, this is a tool for you know mindset is a tool for success you know this is keeping keep this mind you know uh, this issue so the statement says no mindset is a tool for success you need a proper mindset for success and uh, proper mindset means not from the birth to death, right? See, people uh, adapt the proper mindset at the early, you know, age, childhood age. Sometimes, some people adapt this proper mindset, you know, when they become adult. And also, some people, you know, are. Uh, get to the this top you know this um, uh, proper mindset when they are old whoever you know at that at, at whatever time you know if they know you know the mindset they become perfect they become reasonable in their life in their you know they become in the, they'll become orderly you know, and they realize many things. They know what their limitations are. They know what their strengths are. Right? They also know, you know, uh, they, can also, they can also uh, say they have some regrets for their failures, for their mistakes, for their mistakes. Right. So, does anybody know then you know, at what time, you know, uh, at what age this can be learned? Psychology says, you know, this can be learned at any stage. 
right so now we are in a see we are learning you know after plus 2 right so you are you know second year btech second year or sec second semester or fourth semester fourth semester fourth semester yeah Perfect. second year yeah um so when are you learning so now you are learning uh, the mindset topic after i can say around 19 to 20 years right am i right yes sir yeah so you know because it's syllabus you know you have to learn otherwise you know some some people can learn even 40 years at the time of age 40 years also. 40 above at that below, below 40 so what is the purpose of you know uh, knowing uh, the theory or practicality of mindset means you know to develop the right mindset for better future this is the you know, intention of our you know topic suppose one minute So again, you know, <clears throat> wait, wait. That it should not be rude, it should not be, you know, dangerous or arrogance or whatever it is. <clears throat> it should be smart. It should be, what does it mean? You know, when I say smart. Easily can be understood, easily can be influenced, no? easily can be practiced, easily can be, you know, uh, managed in a simple, okay, the word easily. So that is uh, that is the uh, no? definition for smart. Some people say smart people, you know? soft skin, smart, you know, hard, hard is different smart are people born smart the question you know when people you know when somebody is born and child is born is he, is he or she you know uh, smart no sir no so it depends on the training it depends on the, the time you know the family atmosphere you know the surrounding later stays so, no this is okay. then so when somebody on nobody is uh you know become smart but so it means the smartness can be learned later after it has certain skill, you know, itself, you know, it's a skill. Smart is a skill, smart thinking. You know, say, people say smart working, smart thinking, you know, right? Yeah, so, you know, this is what, you know, we'll understand, you know, it's just uh, please uh, keep this topic in your mind. So the smartness of the mind, the awareness, uh, not a like wild, it, you know, it's a simple simplicity, yeah, many things. Smart, simply, easily can be understood, can be influenced, can be, you know, managed, whatever it is. It requires certain, it requires because, you know, parents teach you proper mindset, friends teach you proper mindset, teachers teach you proper mindset. Right? Apart from, you know, syllabus, apart from, you know, exams, all that, you know, is expect the society, you know, expects you to behave with smartness. Huh? Society expects you to behave like you're smart. Then everybody comes to like you. You know? Respect. 
all the time. Okay. Uh, there are some people, you know, who had, you know, succeeded in their life. And what is their mindset now? Right? They were, when they were, you know, they're at the age of early childhood and how they changed over a period of time from childhood to adult, adult to, you know, whatever it is, different states, elder level. Mm -hmm. Right? So, the example I'm going to give you some people, you know, expert, uh, you know, uh, greatest personalities, you know, um, style, you know, the, the circle of lifestyle, you know, from birth to, from child to adult, to couple, you know, uh, up to there. How they, you know, when they are child, how they changed after some time, after some period of time, some years of time. Okay. Winston Churchill, you might have known this person. Are you aware of the name? No, sir. Bengal yeah. Yes, yes. Sorry, who is he? Of England. Okay, yes, sir. Then Churchill. So now uh, everybody knows. Okay, he's you know he was a prime minister. He was a PM of England. It means he's a smart. You know he has achieved. I used to. Not nowadays. You know nowadays people are different. At that time, you know they have ideals, everything. You know? Right. So and what is his performance as far as concerned? Mindset is the definition for mindset. Going in a proportion or uh, improvement, right? Or you know, uh, showing okay, great thing in their life. And this person, you know, uh, Churchill didn't develop. Uh, when he was in school and what what way to turn up later you know he repeat a grade during elementary he was placed in the lowest division of the lowest class in fact he might have failed as for class, elementary school. Then when did he get? Then after understanding chance. Just one thing, you know, but not this is chance for you to improve that after. Am I right? You know, Beethoven, you know, uh, one of the uh, music companies. Right? So when he was a child, you know, his teacher called him a hopeless. He didn't know in a teacher his real talent. It's, you know, teachers and this person. Uh, uh, Okay. Show proper mindset. 
And later he wrote five out of five of his greatest symphonies while while you know deaf. He's, he's a deaf. Symphonies, you know, master class pieces of you know music. I just Are you aware of the name? Leo Tolstoy? It is from and uh, romanticism is a start. Yeah, yeah, he's a writer. Warsworth, William Warsworth is a romantist, right? Romantic poet. He's not a poet. He's a realist. No, sir, he started. No, no, he never started. Uh, Russo, Russo was. Okay. No, 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 Leo Tosai text produced. Unable and unwilling to learn by his teachers at school. knows who is he one of the religious found you know reformist are we together are you listening yes sir Swami Vekananda he, he you know he he was unable to teach in a school that is why you know school dismissed him from the teacher post and how you know people changed at later stages many examples we have can you remember and recall, you know, story of greatest people, you know, how you might know Dr. Rajkumar, one of the best singer and actor, you know, in Kannada language, you know, he was fourth standard field 
in education, correct? A role model and taught many things to the masses. Can you give such examples if you are aware of them? Many IIT dropouts, you know, became millionaire and then successful entrepreneurs. Failed people, right, in education. Ambani or Adhan, who is that person? Worked in a petrol bank, somebody told me. Is this true? Check all these facts, you know. I'm just telling you, I know. I read somewhere. Now they're, you know, they're, you know, giving direction to the people. Millions, you know, lakhs of people. Again, one more will coming. You know, everybody is familiar of the name Einstein. Einstein's teachers said that he was academically subnormal. Abnormal is not a normal, you know, he doesn't remember many things. Dull student. Who is who was a dull student? Einstein. Michael Jordan. Yeah. Sport, you know, the best coach. Said, you know, he was not more talented than other people. But later, you know, he became a top coach. Walt Disney. He was a painter. You know, was told that, you know, he lacked creative imagination. These are people. So everybody know, okay, Einstein was the greatest from school to last days, no? Generally, that they believe after listening to the success stories, but school, you know, Einstein himself told, I failed, you know, school because school failed me. It was not, you know, poor, very poor. So many examples, you know, we have here. If you look at many stories, you know, we can see. So the lesson, you know, out of all these examples for us, you know, to learn the possibility of our life, possibility of our, you know, possibility to get success. You know, there's a, there's a hope, you know, hope is instilled, you know. There is a, some saying, you know, where there is a mind, where, what is that? Where there's a mind, there's a will. Way. Where there is a will, there is a way. Wonderful. Well, yeah. Where there's a will, there's a way. Will means, you know, willingness, minds, mind, you know, mindset. So mind itself one, set is another one. You have to set the mind properly. That's our mindset. If you don't set the mind properly, Mind destroyer, you know, it, it is not like it. We'll know, you know, what it is. You have to set the mind. So, you know, if these are examples, if those people are not always as amazing as me, what happened? Right? Intelligent person, you know, the cat intelligent, so intelligent, thinks. All the time intelligent, but not these successful people are not. No, not at all. What happened? Why? Some people, you know, there's also an example, you know, another side. Certain stage, you know, in school, college, some people are very intelligent, very, very intelligent. When they go to higher education, they lag behind. That is why, you know, you might all this, you know. Observe this. 
some of you also you know you know uh, at the time of 10th standard or high school you know your classmates some of classmates might have you know uh, might have performed very well than you right where are they now have they entered iit, NIT? they are more better than you, you know? they were more they are far better than you at that time where are they now all intelligent people only entered iit or iit what about others those who are intelligent those who got more uh, more uh, uh, you know score and better comments from your teachers and the performance everything overall best performance as a student not right not like right some of some of them still you know left behind right even if they're intelligent am i right just remind can you recall some examples you have at least Arshay, yeah, yes or no? Do you know? Yes, sir. So it means at that time their mindset was good, but not now. You know, this is what continuously no one has to manage, you know, easily. There are two types of mindset, you know, I'm just talking about. One is growth mindset. Uh, okay. Uh, here, yeah. Fixed mindset is one. Growth mindset is another one. Okay. Yeah. Uh, just read one by slide. That's okay. Growth mindset is, you know, what it says. Intelligence is a, you know, malleable quality to be developed. What is, you know, malleable? It's like uh, soft, you know, it is not hard. Easily can be, you know, changed. So that, that means intelligence, you know, knowledge talent is you know not fixed that is what the growth mindset you know it can be changed at any time you know last year you might have been a very bad performance now if you do hard work you know immediately you develop intelligence you develop intelligence sir yes but IQ almost remains fixed for the entire life. That is stories. But what is the use of you know having all this, all that? You know, there should be growth, right? There should be practicality, right? There should be you know space, you know, for that IQ. Uh, it should be utilized. My point is, it should be utilized, right? If it is not utilized. No, it is, see, what I, what I mean here, maybe, you know, somebody has unique brain and IQ, but certain stage, you know, proper training all the time is required. If there's no training, you know, you know, the result is lack in performance starts, you know. A lack in performance, you know, Fa performance failure, you know, happens. I know some of the exceptional cases are there, you know, being uh, some some kids, you know, I know uh, they are just it's like experimental level, you know, they're just like high school students. They have more IQ than you know PhD holder. Maybe you know. It's it's connected to genes, fine, DNA, whatever it is. But what theory it says, you know, growth mindset uh, believes the psychology, right? It's a, so it believes intelligence can be changed, intelligence can be influenced, can be, you know, fixed cannot be fixed. My point is that no, cannot be fixed. 
at a particular level there's a possibility for it you know to uh what i can say to modify it that is why you know somebody suppose somebody met accident what happens serious damage to the brain Sometimes he forgets everything, right? Right? Lost everything, lost language. Am I right? Yes, sir. What happens? You know, again, the person is admitted to psycho psychologists, psychoanalysts, or, you know, mentally, or, you know, psychiatrists, whatever it is. You know, there are many people. So after many years of training, Science believes, you know, the memory can be restored. Memory can be restored with his incidents, with his in a lot of films also. You know, you see that you know everything. You know, they try to you know make him or her to remember many things. So that what does it indicate? It can be changed, right? Am I right? No. Did you get my point? Somebody asked question, right? It's not a fixed. There's a possibility to but recall. A, but it changes through damage to the brain. That's what you know. That's what change, change is important. Not fixed. You say, okay, I have, I know, uh, this type of 90% days of mindset, you know, when I was a child, you know, until death, you know, there's no guarantee, you know, you retain the same thing when you are alive. Am I right? Yes, sir. That's that is what the principle behind the growth mindset. That is the reason we have also seen a lot of examples here, right? There are many people, you know, Tolstoy, Einstein, many people here, Churchill. Their IQ is not good when they are child. But later, they're powerful, you know, they became powerful, intelligent human beings. Understand, right? Just you know, keep this in mind. So I think it was not a sudden growth that happened over the years, but it was their different mindset, which was not as per the metrics of their measuring. So the schools failed to understand their mindsets. That's and true. Then That's true. The real world uh, I don't know, because see, whatever it is, no? so that it was not revealed at that time. But later, uh, you know, it is revealed, right? And some other people also, they were revealed, not this person at that time, right? Uh, Einstein classmates might have, you know, achieved a good mindset, but not Einstein at that time. Don't blame teacher here and don't blame the system. The reason is that certain mind, certain body, human body requires time. Certain body captures immediately, right? Am I right? Right? So bodily structure of, you know, our certain brain captures, you know, things very quickly. Somebody is not as much quick as, you know, another. Right? I'm telling you, you know, see, somebody, uh, see, I know because, you know, we are all, you know, more than 100 here, you know, in the class. I teach same syllabus to all. Same class I'll take to all, right? But in exam, in the performance, not all perform equally. I know it depends on their mindset. How they grow, if somebody has grown, you know, there should be change, there should be improvement. That is what the growth mindset believes, right? Somebody is a poor, suppose, you know, in the beginning, and then there's a chance for him to, you know, excel, you know, from the first rank also, to, to, to the level of first rank also. Right? Is this true? Yes, sir. You have to change mindset, that's what, you know, growth, make it grow. You know? 
know this is one type of mindset again we're coming on that one yeah so benjamin bob is one of the you know finest uh, entrepreneurs i think i don't divide the world into weak and strong our successes and failures i divide the world into learners and non learners what does it mean wonderful quotation right so therefore if we say einstein was weak he was useless what happens he never produced many theories many knowledge right learning is important learner become a learner no failures no success no weak or no strong only learn and then learning versus non learning if you learn you change if you don't learn you know you will lose that's all you will lose mm -hmm. right So what happened? What's the problem in Jharkhand uh, internet ban? Is there any news? Somebody is asking me here. Yes, sir. Why? Most of the students are not able to join because of that. What's the problem? Uh, network connection is totally shut down and. Uh, in Jharkhand. Yes, sir. In many places of Jharkhand, almost 15 to 16 students are not able to join because of that. Who who stopped internet? MIT. Are any so other uh, maybe government because they got a message uh, saying that whenever government will allow for network reconnection, we will start. Achha. So it means some problem, you know, for digital, uh, you know, performance today. You know, yes, see somebody, you know, just now messaged me. There is some problem, you know. I don't know why, you know. So, any like you know, uh, like uh, precautionary steps from the government? I don't know. No, sir. As any between people. Sorry. Dispute arising between people. Acha clashes. Yeah. Political. Political. Huh? No, sir. Yes. It's called basically a uh, ch child is killed by some an another community. So Achha. there is a community. Where, where, where is that place? In Bari, uh, Hazari Bagh district. Achha. I know it's like socially, you know, provoked. But what what is the relation between that and, okay, in this, that reason only it is. What about others? This reason, there's no problem in Jamshedpur. Okay, so whatever it is. Uh, we have at least some no not a problem but you know i don't want to you know uh, lose any student you know in my class that is also my concern because if they lose it's my problem right if with knowing you know they do that is they left to them <clears throat> okay so where is it? Yeah. So as I said, you know, there is a picture here, you know. So what is uh, I said two levels of mindset. 
right? Left side is one. What is that? This is the way my intelligence is fixed, fixed mindset. And then no intelligence will grow and develop. It is not fixed. This is what? Growth mindset. Now, what is the difference between these two? When in a fixed, you know, people believe no change can happen. It's fixed. Means by birth, you know, some people fix, okay, you know, we have all the time, you know, our we are different, you know, we, we have unique intelligence. But some people say, another group, another psychology, another uh, school of thought. Yes. So one has a capacity, one has the ability to change his mindset over a period of time. Right? So, so do you like this or that, just So now the question is, what is good, what is not good? No. There's a possibility here, no, one can shift from this to that, that level. You know? Some people have, in a certain stage, you know, some people have a fixed mindset. Uh, after some years, you know, they, you know, uh, they enter into, you know, growth mindset. So, what I believe, you know, uh, one should know, you know, your intelligence can also be grown, you know, with proper training, with proper, you know, uh, mindset. Like a tree, you know, like a tree. Here is a box, you know, no, it's closed box here. Tree, you know, it will grow. That is the mindset. Now, now we are exactly coming. What people, you know, since we have, you know, more than ten slides, we just give some background. You know, psychologist, uh, you know, Carol and Vic had has conducted, you know, a lot of research. about mindset and what is mindset somebody asked what is mindset first line first line say it So mindset is a belief about one's ability. It's a belief about one's ability. Got the point? It's a belief about one's ability. And it affects decisions relating to learning. So we have to believe the first basic principle, you know, in uh, human English is a belief. Belief in learning, belief in ability, belief in others, belief in faith, 
Many things. Belief in institutions, belief in an individual. So what is what is now? Mindset is a belief about ability, no? Intelligence, capacity. Two type of beliefs here. Fixed, somebody you know, has a fixed intelligence is a fixed trait, quality. And then other is growth. Intelligence can be trained. The brain is a growth. Okay. It is the brain, you know, you say growth. So human mind is all the time, right? It's like, uh, you know, changing from, you know, it's, 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 at, a, at a moment, you know, at a moment, all of a sudden it changes from one domain to another, you know, one, just a, a fraction of a second, you know, you enter somewhere, you know, remote places, you know, different place of the world. And immediately come back to the place over here. Right? There is no limit for the mind. Is there a limit for the mind? Tell me. Can anybody say, is there a limit for the mind? No, sir. No, sir. So then there is a growth. How do we limit, you know? People have a fixed mindset. That's why you know, they limit. OK, somebody, you know, people you know, believe, you know, people judge other people, you know, and based on, you know, their background, their region, religion, their community, cost, whatever it is, you know, their food style, whatever. Don't do that. So their mind can be you know, changed. Their belief, you know, their strength, their, their belief on their strengths can be changed. Now, you know, that is okay. So, you know, we'll... Uh, so, this is the definition. And that belief obviously affects, you have to believe, you know, otherwise you don't achieve anything. Right? Shall we stop here? Any questions? Until this, you know, we have again, you know, some classes we have to take, place on the two classes for this. Okay, so you can leave. Uh, uh, see you in next class. Thank Bye. you, sir. Thank you, sir. Thank you, sir.